my brother Seamus, my eldest brother Seamus, he's deceased now. I think I was about 10 years of age and in the middle of winter he was taking his, his fishing boat in from just up the coastline there and unfortunately the fishing boat tumbled over and Seamus was swept into the sea and he travelled right the whole way down Strangford Lock and he was saying that he could hear these whirly sounds but he travelled the whole way down Strangford Lock and he ended up on the other side, Port of Ferry side with a clump of trees and my other brother who I look after he followed him all down the coastline shouting to him, Seamus, Seamus, are you all right? And they had a conversation back and forth. Paddy knew he was safe, but we didn't know he was safe. And I remember the story, my mum, she was walking around the house and she was saying the rosary. My daddy was effing and blind. And I had my brother Seamus's first child in my arms and a wheener months old, Lisa, my first niece and that's a story so anytime I'm out in the, in the site I just imagine him just floating down there swimming down the Strangford Lock. <laughs>